Ayash. Uh, hello, Ruth. Yeah, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm just doing good. How? What about you? I'm fine. I'm good. So usually you have more people on this call, but it just seems uh, it's the both of us. So I think I'll just start because we're like eleven minutes into um the time. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. So um. So the first thing usually is. Uh, you give like an introduction. I know you've given that on the chat, but yeah, you can like give um, an introduction of yourself. Uh, so, uh, uh, can you repeat your voice? Is actually breaking. Okay, can you hear me now? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so this is actually like a new commerce call. I know um, Lee mentioned that when you introduce yourself, right? Okay. So um, this call actually runs every Thursday by um, 8 a.m. Um, oh. So uh, so this call, generally what we do here is just like um, take questions, introduce the AFI community and projects that you might want to contribute to. So that's basically oh. what we do on this call. So you can always join in. It's not like it's not restricted to just uh, first contributors you can always join in as many times as you want so okay. i i know you've introduced yourself on the on the channel but just can you do another introduction here uh so uh so are you uh should i shall i introduce myself right now yeah you can okay so uh so yeah um uh, so you know as you know my name is yash and uh, currently, I'm just a BTEC undergrad student at Indian Institute of Technology, uh, Mandi, and I'm pursuing data science branch. Uh, so I don't have much experience with the open source, but uh, as of now, but I'm really excited to start my journey with Relay 5 community. And uh, basically, I spend my time uh, solving maths problem and uh, doing MLEI stuff. That's it. Okay, that's great. So I didn't get your like the stack, the programming languages uh, you use. Uh, I I basically know about Python and C plus plus languages as of now. Oh, uh, Python and C plus plus. Okay. Yeah. That's that's great. Uh, can you see my screen? Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's good. So let me just quickly check if someone else is on the call. Okay, that's just uh, the both of us. Okay, that's fine. So I, I already dropped a reminder on the Slack in case any other person like wants to join the call. So um, like I said earlier, this is not the call is not strictly for newcomers. It's open to anyone to join, and the call is always recorded. So okay. uh, just give me a sec. Just give me a second, let me. Okay, hi, yes. I'm sorry, I just needed to exit my WhatsApp. Oh. Yeah. So, yeah, so like I said, um, the call is always recorded, right? So um, you can always catch up on, because usually on the call, we have like tutorials. Um, we we have tutorials that come up like um, introduction to Meshri, introduction to, um, oh different um different projects right so the call is always recorded and you can find it on the youtube channel if you navigate to this link you can find a whole lot of um, recordings i think there's also a playlist which i'll i'll check on that later there's also like a newcomers playlist on youtube so we have mm -hmm. a whole lot of that so um 
there's an overview of um, um, there are five projects. We have a repository overview. If you click on this link, it takes you to a document hmm. that has um, an overview of each project, like a list of the front end project, back end projects, and um, like more context about what um, each pro project entails, um, programming languages, and thereabouts. So if you can still see my screen yeah 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 I so you see um like there's context on each project and even trainings right so you could um there's you could learn about the r5 um there's we have um a platform where you can learn about service meshes and thereabouts so it, also on this doc, we have um, a first timers welcome. I haven't been able to find any issue to contribute to. So then your stack is Python and C++, right? Yeah, I know the basics of Golang also. Like oh, I've been that's learning good. Things. Uh, but yeah, at very basic level. Oh, okay. Um, so I think a good project for you would be um, Meshri CTL. Uh, yeah, yeah. Right. Uh, I have you checked that out? On, yes. Uh, okay. Okay. Have you checked it out already? The Meshri CTL project? Uh, no, no, no. I I didn't check it till now, but uh, I've I've know the basics of the mesh mesh service. Okay. Like I saw. Have you been tutorial. able to set up? No, no. I I I'm, I'm yet to set up, but yeah, I think that won't be an issue to set up. For yeah, me. we also have like the we have we have um the the docs is actually really very explanatory. The docs is really explanatory and also there's also a video right there's also um a um a tutorial that was um done i think sometime sometime last month or two months ago about setting up meshery so i think one of the community members um um set up meshery on the call and that call was recorded so just in case you like you're having any issue or any problem you can refer back to that video or you ask questions on the on the new commerce channel or general channel, whichever channel is um, comfortable for you to ask questions, right? Well, since you have um, like basics, you know um, some uh, basics of Golang, a good project for you to start with would be the Meshri CTL because it's it's a small project first and it's it's managed by Nav Navendu. I don't know if you know Navendu, but he's really very welcoming and you know he can show you you can show you around um contributing to Mesh Recitio. Right. Okay. So um so aside that, um aside that we have um so if you if you check here, this is the new commerce guide, right? So if you go to that link you see you see um a document on everything on starting a project right like yeah yeah so if you read through you'd get context on um starting an issue or picking up or what to do generally you get so also on this document you have um, we 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 kind of created created um, GitHub issues right. So if you click on this help wanted here, it takes you. Um, we did a search query for issues that are labeled help wanted and they have not like been assigned to anybody, and they are on the um, there are five organization and the issues are open. So if you click there. It takes you to um, the open issues that you can start um, start with. But since you you said your stack is uh, Python, C plus plus, I don't except you know a little bit of HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. You might be able to contribute to the front end project. But if that is not the case, uh, yeah, I know the basics of HTML, of course. Oh, okay, that, that, that's good because we have like we have um we have four projects, I think four that runs on GQ. Have you heard about GQ? Uh no, no, no. GQ line I'm not very uh okay, so okay. GQ is a static site generator. Okay. So let me search that up. So it's a static site generator. I think just uh HTML, CSS and little javascript so 
the issues are really very like we have up to four four projects like the mesh-free, the mesh-free, um docs um site and the mesh-free site has they they run, they both run on gkill like uh, sorry let me not pick it back so see this this test site here the mesh-free the io mesh-free um the docs mesh-free the layer five there's layer five repository um, sites and the smp site they all run on gkill right so you can as well contribute since you said you like have some knowledge of html and css right so you can also contribute um to either of this of this project right so if you if you navigate to this um this url the help wanted so you see that there are a whole lot of issues that are still open that like need help with uh con like you see this one this particular one is a documentation issue it's about um troubleshooting a metric troubleshooting guide right mm -hmm. so you can also i think maybe I'll, I'll send this one on the chat on the chat so that you can check it out if you want to like but it's really very it's not so complicated so you can start with this one i, th I think you okay. mentioned you've not um done any issue i uh, know i haven't done any issue till now okay so i think this is a good start for you okay uh, can right. you share the link? Uh, the document sure. link. Yeah. Sure, sure, I will. Definitely. Yeah. Um. So let me share it. Okay, I'll just share it after the call. Is that fine? Okay. So um. Also, aside. Uh, so we also have a site that runs on Gatsby, but I do not think that will be particular to you. Gatsby. Um. Um. The site. It's still in development. It's not launched yet. So if you navigate, it's still hosted on Netlify. Uh, basically, I'm interested in the backend project, like the one related oh, okay. to Go Okay. Okay. Yeah, so so starting, I think the good start for you will be Meshri CTL. Actually, it's the, the um the command line tool for Meshri. So it's a small project, and getting started with that would be okay. really good for you. So that that you could use this um the the layer five repository overview to like check on the backend project and really get involved, right? Okay. Yeah. So. Also, we have uh, something called the MeshMate program, where you can apply. So, a MeshMate is someone that you know handholds you to your first pull request, a like a direct person of contact to you. Okay. Yeah. So, if you want to apply for a MeshMate, you can just navigate to this link. Sorry, let me send this document to the chat so you have. Oh, do you have access to it? Uh you have to get the access also i guess no it's it's open once you just have the link so let me send okay. it to the ch oh sorry once you have the link you can edit so that's it i just sent it to the chat oh wait a minute okay so um yeah, exactly. so okay you have it now right so if you navigate here you can apply to like get a mesh mate and somebody would you know take you through so we take you through contribute um all right so okay. you can see you can see i'm also i'm also part of the mesh me but i wouldn't be able to help um with uh, contributing to mesh ctl but once you sign up for a mesh mate we have like a parent a parent system where you get um paired with someone that will, you know Hand some like um, a personal contact that will really handhold you to contributing, right? So you can okay. apply for that, yeah. So also, we have um, a hands on tutorial, right? So if you navigate here, so you could there are like two, two courses up, um about meshery and performance testing. So since you say you're like in, interested in the backend project, this um, this uh, tutorial, this tutorial should really be like helpful to you. Okay. 
yeah so um also um like i i told you there's there's a link to there's a link to all the to, because this call usually on this call um tutorials are usually done on this call so if you navigate to this link you would like see a list of a list of all the tutorials that have been taken on the newcomers call right mm. yeah then also you could um contribute via just in case you like see any problem remember you can always create an issue you must not always contribute to existing issues you like can create an issue or you can talk about what you want to implement or anything so you're not limited to um solving existing issues yeah okay so uh i think then okay this is the link for the newcomers like the recordings for this call so if you navigate here i think we have a created playlist on youtube mm -hmm. yeah okay uh and also you could add you could add each meeting this is not the only meeting like there's they're yeah, like i think three meeting three meetings in a week there's the mystery um development meeting and the newcomers meeting and then there's the community meeting so you can navigate this thing and you know add them also add to your calendar right okay yeah so um also uh lastly and um, we have um an open source questionnaire so if you click here it's just uh, a short google form you know to basically filling tutorials that you want to see so you should try to fill in this and just a couple of questions if you want immersed mates and if you want to be added to the mailing list so mm -hmm. you could check out this for um this questionnaire and just fill it up right okay. so i think i think that's like basically most of what i want to say do you have like any question at this point uh I, no i don't have any such particular question um, but i i tried solving those good first issues but they weren't they weren't that good so do you have any suggestion like how can how should i proceed solving those issues uh, like i found them difficult and those terms were uh, like advanced to me okay so um um can you can you send me a link of one of them so usually if you if you see the issue and it looks quite technical for you to yeah. you you could add at the person who created the issue that i give you more context on what what to rep, um what to fix right and definitely the person will throw in an answer right so but if in in the case where it's still technical after after um after the explanation right then yeah. you you could um you you could ask for like help on the on the general channel right you could ask yeah. for help on the general channel on how to sort out the issue but usually we advise like first timers to look at this we also have the first timers label so those issues are really, really very easy to implement. But basically, asking questions um, on the channel and as a comment on the issue would really help to, you know, get give you like more context. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So that's like, but you you can always ask on the newcomer channel, general channel, or just ask as the person mm -hmm. that created the issue. So. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. So, is there like any other question you have? Uh, no, I don't have any questions at this point of time. Okay, so feel free to reach out to me anytime. Usually, this call runs for one hour, but because uh, for today is just um, Yash and Root, we yeah. definitely have to end it here. Uh, okay. Also, I was supposed to add the attendees, so let me just put that in before the call goes off. So you could add your name in. You have the link, right? Uh, yeah, exactly. Yeah. All right, that's good. So um, I'll send the issue, the issue I saw about the documentation. I'll send it to you. And if you have any yeah. issues, then 
just let me know on Slack. I'm also with Ikiga on Slack. Yeah, okay. All right. Mm-hmm. Enjoy the rest yeah. of your... I'm sure it's evening there, so enjoy the rest of your yeah. evening. Actually, it's, uh, it's 8 p.m., so um, yeah. it's more like it's, dinner it's, time. It's, it's around, it's around uh, 3.30 p.m. here. It's very oh. sunny. Yeah, good, good. Yeah. All right. Thanks okay. for joining the call. You can yeah. always join in next week, too. Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay, thanks yeah, for this sure. explanation. Yeah, right. my pleasure. All right. All right, okay. Bye. Bye.